The bookmap heat map shows a graphical representation of liquidity in the current and historical order book. Let's take a look at the current order book column or COB column here. This is your depth of market or dome or your level two. This column displays both numerical values and histogram of the limit sell orders at the best offer and above and the limit buy orders at the best bid and below. This is liquidity. Note how these numbers change all the time. Once they change, it is not possible to view what was previously displayed. In bookmap, we take the numerical values in the COB column and transform them into a graphical heat map. You'll see the numerical values change here in the COB column and it is reflected in the heat map in the live market window here to the right of the vertical white line. The colors of the heat map represent the amount of liquidity at each price level. The scale of the heat map is here at the top center of the bookmap app. Red and orange are very high liquidity. Yellow and white have less liquidity and blue and black have the least amount of liquidity. When you see the liquidity change at an area in the COB column, you'll see it change here in the live market window in the heat map. However, in bookmap, we take the liquidity heat map and then record it and plot it onto the historical chart to the left of the vertical white line. Thus, you can see the entire order book history plotted on the chart. Now you can see the context of price action and the volume dots with the historical order book within the heat map. The heat map may appear daunting or complex. It is not. These color striations are simply the adding and pulling of liquidity captured over time. You can precisely see when liquidity was added or pulled, how long it stayed into the market, and if it transacted. This will give you excellent insight into the condition of the market auction and where price might go next to test areas of high liquidity. Please note, Bookmap takes the highest area of liquidity within the viewable chart range and then paints it red. All other liquidity is scaled from the highest amount. If we zoom in and out, an area that was previously low liquidity may now become an area of comparably higher liquidity and thus the heat map color will change. However, the specific amount of liquidity has not changed at all. It is recorded historically. If desired, you can always use the data tooltip to check out the exact quantity of liquidity at specific areas. Click here on the data tooltip and then hover over areas on the heat map to see the exact amount of liquidity at that specific area.